Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by today. It is Tuesday, the 5th of January, 2021. It's the new year, folks. And Blackpool, like the rest of Britain, has been put into a full lockdown. So that may mean changes for the channel because I can't just go out walking everywhere and filming whatever I want. As the rules are now, we're only allowed out for shopping for essentials, which I'm on my way to do now, or exercise, and medical, emergency, etc. a few other things. So this today will be my only walk of the day. I'm going to combine my exercise walk with my walk to the shops and vlog on the way while I'm walking. So right now I'm on Coronation Street and it's looking like a lovely bright day, at least on the right hand side of the road it is because that's the direction the sun's shining. On this side, the side I'm on, is a little duller. So maybe, I think, I will cross over into the sun. I'm just on my way to Sainsbury's. So, if all my daily walks are going to be just on my way to the shops I'm going to have to think of different routes to take to the shops so I'm not walking the same way all the time this way is probably a little quicker anyway I'm just going to turn up Hornby Road as expected it's super quiet today both on the road and pedestrian people wise so I'm just going to head on up Hornby until I can turn down park and head on towards Sainsbury this is probably the quickest way really so I do have Hornby Road on my Streets of Blackpool series for those of you that want to see the whole thing so what's the new year bringing in for me i am looking forward to things picking up later on right now same as with everyone it's just a bit of same old same old i'm back on furlough again the country's back in lockdown again so it's a whole lot of deja vu right now. As for my YouTube channel, it was starting to do really well and it's still doing okay. But last week of December, first week in January, my views and everything have definitely dropped. I guess that's just the time of the year. But we're going to keep going folks. Look, the Raffles Hotel, Blackbird Apartments. There's so many nice hotels and guest houses down Hornby Road, and it's a great place to stay because you're out of town, as in you're not close to the town centre noise wise, but distance wise. You're pretty much fairly close to everything because if you just walk up to the lights where I'm walking towards now and take a left, you're heading towards Sainsbury's. If you walk in the other direction, down there, you're heading towards Central Drive and the promenade. Then you're also not that far from town. 
but yeah, good road, Hornby Road, to stay on. And I have heard people saying that some of the hotels on here are really nice. Beachfield Hotel, that's a big one. Done in that eye-catching, cheerful, lime green colour. Look, even the van matches the hotel. And the planters and everything. Very nice. Definitely a green theme going on there, folks. Look at that. We're almost at... To get to the lights I'm just going to turn around and head down Park Road and on to All Sainsbury's. On the right there is the Langdale's Care Home. That make a great house that. Love to live in a big house like that. Big detached house. Just ahead there on the corner of Hornby Road and Park Road, you can see the Gateway Campus, part of the college buildings. Many years ago when I was younger, that used to be a part of a catering college I think, and then it changed to a technical college, but now it's the Gateway Campus. Hornby Road, as you can see. There we've got the St John's Ambulance. And now I'm just going to head uphill to the last bit of Park Road. This will finish at Rakes Parade, where the Salvation Army building is. Nice interesting building there, probably several apartments. Imagine if that was one house. That'd be so cool. If that was my house, I would have my bedroom in that very top turret window there. It'd be nice and small, but I'd have one small room just for sleeping in and I'd put my bed right in the turret. So I could wake up in the morning, sit up, and just see in all directions. It really is a quiet day today. But it's lovely and bright, nice blue skies, and we don't have any snow. Now, in my heart, I love snow. And when it starts to snow, my first thought is the little child in my heart that comes out and he's like, way, it's snowing. I hope it snows and snows, I hope it sticks, I hope it gets really deep. But the adult in me says, don't be an idiot. You know, if it snows and snows, it's going to play havoc with everything and everybody. But we do, as we all know, very rarely get snow in Blackpool. We get little bits and little flurries now and again. But as for the snow sticking and actually staying there for a few days, those moments are very rare indeed. But yeah, I do like snow, I've got to say. Well, at least I like it when it's fluffy and white and falling through the skies. I don't like it when it's dirty and slushy, like a giant spilled slush puppy. 
and then it gets into your boots and you feel that horrible moment where it leaks through to your socks and you feel that freezing cold wet hit your toes yeah that bit's not fun but I have got a pair of nice boots now because I've shown you them in my other video the ones my daughter bought me for Christmas a nice pair of rocket dog boots so it's kind of cool to have warm comfy feet for a change nice to wear something that isn't joined together by hope and glue and plastic bands and duct tape well here we are now folks about to hit the corner of Park Road Church Street and Rakes Parade so I'm going to finish this video now I'm going to say thank you so much for watching please leave me a like maybe a comment and please subscribe and i will see you all very soon in the next video goodbye